Welcome to Mark Reed 757. I wanted to do a little different video today. Uh, today's going to be about disc golf and it's also going to be completely on the go. As you can see I'm in my car currently and I'm heading to our local disc golf course. It's less than 10 minutes away from me, Faircrest. Uh, it's in a nice little park. The, <laughs> beside them is a juvenile detention center. I've played it this many times and there's never any issue so nothing to worry about there anyway this is gonna be a fun little video to do I I was gonna start off in the car and then we're gonna go ahead and show you some disc golf footage hopefully at least nine holes I'm gonna go ahead and play on the shorts and then I'll play on the longs later but for right now for just the video I want to play on the shorts so this will tell you a little bit more about disc golf Welcome to W.C. Griffith Park. This is where I'm going to show you uh, disc golfing. Here's hole one. Here's hole one and this is my first shot. I'm going to use the bolt. Not bad for a first shot. Pretty happy with it. For putting, I'm going to use a wizard. If I switch up discs, I'll uh, mention that disc before I throw it. Nothing like missing an easy putt. There we go. This is definitely challenging without a cameraman, but I will throw the bolt again. This is a smaller bolt. I kind of expected that. Take a little bit for me to get to my disc. Here hole three I'm going to use the bolt again. This time I'm going to go backhand instead of forehand. I uh, feel like that might be a little bit better opportunity for me. <laughs> However I see that I'm on the long so I'm going to quietly take this up to the shorts. <laughs> the long posts are usually signified with the red. Red little banner. And the shorts have a uh, gray one. Uh, kind of forgot which what I was doing. Uh, I guess that happens at times. Anyway, here's hole three. Farther to the left than I expected, but uh, should be a doable shot. If we can't make this back to back birdies. There we go. It's starting to sprinkle now. 
Again, I'm going to do a back end with the bolt. Uh, wish me luck on this one. Went a little better than I expected, but it definitely went farther to the left than I wanted. This is a little farther than I usually get a birdie, but let's give it a shot. Oh. At least it gives me for an easy three. And getting par on here is something I always like. Go ahead and put this in for par. This still puts me at uh, two down for the course. If we're already on hole four. Let's see how the rest of it goes. Could do all this with multiple takes, but uh, honestly, I am only doing this with one take because one, it'd be a little more difficult for me. I do not have a cameraman. Anyway, this will be another bolt. I think I'll sidearm it. Still got a shot at another deuce. So another birdie, that'd be nice. Anyway, let's see what happens. Ready to try to get another birdie to put me from three down. Oh, missed that one. We'll just have to settle for par. Never had a doubt. This is definitely tricky with no cameraman, but also manageable. Still two down after six. Uh, I'm definitely not one of the elite players in the area. <laughs> but it's uh, more about having fun. This is a nice park. Five down and four holes to go. This is going to be another backhand shot with the bolt. The only problem with these short tees is they're really, really short, so it's hard to determine your run up. Anyway. All right, ready to give this a shot again. This one's a decently far one, too, even though it's short. I'm gonna try the bolt back in. my worst shot I had today. Ugh. Live and learn, right? Ready, let's try to get safe par. Oh, I missed. Yeah, only one down now. That's disappointing. Bogey of the day. 
We got two more holes to go. I'm gonna attempt a forehand shot with the, the bolt. Kind of hoping I can get a two on this one. All right, all right. Try for a birdie in hole eight. Oh, just barely missed it. Oh well. I'd still be under par for the day. That's still kind of nice. All right. I'm at least safe for. I think I can make this one. Incredibly easy shot. Right. Hey, see, I'm really trying hard on that one. <laughs> hey, you'd be surprised. Sometimes you miss those, especially if you get too confident. This is the last hole, and it's going to be a little bit different shot. I'm gonna use uh, the Excalibur and I'm gonna do a roller. Uh, the reason why I need to do a roller is over here is the, uh, let's see, the basket. And over there you have to throw it around the tree. Uh, the person that created this course, his dad used to love to race and that's kind of why he wanted to have this kind of hole and it's an interesting one. I, it's grown on me. <laughs> let's go give it a try. That did not go as planned. That was supposed to turn off a lot sooner. However, uh, I'll just go where it's played. More of an insane shot. I gotta walk up a hill. Anyway, uh, let's give this a shot. Gotta be careful going down, too. Oh, boy, oh, that's way off. I'm more than likely gonna get a bogey on this one, which will put me at even. <sighs> Last hole. Uh, let's see here. I'm trying to make it a par. Oh boy. No such luck. This hole I'm shooting for uh, even. This means it'd be uh, one over for the hole and even overall. Real fun. I'll see you back at the car. Hey, if you made it this far, I, I really appreciate uh, you taking the time out to watch it. This is uh, going to be really fun to do. Uh, I got some other videos in store that I like to do. Not all disc golfing, but just, uh, just some different things. Uh, kind of nice that I can take the camera on the go. Anyway, have a good rest of your day. <laughs>